Let's take a look at the rise of wind power technology as a source of renewable energy. Good day to everyone, this is Arthur, and of course, this is Richard Aguilar, and welcome back again to our channel. But before we get started, don't forget to subscribe and tick the bell icon for you to always be updated with our new videos. Wind power or wind energy is the use of wind to provide a mechanical power through wind turbines to turn electric generators, and traditionally to do other work like milling or pumping. Wind power is a sustainable and renewable energy and has a much smaller impact on the environment compared to burning fossil fuels. So today, in this video, we are about to show you the rise of wind power technology as a source of renewable energy. So without further delay, let us take it to our number one. Number one is a Texas town leads the country in using solar and wind energy. Texas continues to dominate the nation's wind energy production, adding far more generating capacity than any other state and having more installed wind power capacity than all but five countries in the world, the U.S. Energy Department stated. The state's wind energy production, meanwhile, is only expected to increase and provide a growing share of the state's electricity as advancing technology allows turbines to generate at lower wind speeds and improve weather forecasting makes it easier to integrate it into the grid. Number two is Southern China County boosts wind power. Generating wind power needs just the right geological and wind conditions. After careful investigation back in 2010, the State Power Investment Corporation decided to build a large wind power project in Xing'an County of the Guangxi Zhuang Autonomous Region. Number three is U.S. Bill's first offshore wind farm. In the U.S. today, Wind power accounts for about 5% of all electricity generation, but a new project aims to change that. A $300 million installation of the coast of Block Island, Rhode Island takes the renewable energy technology out to sea. Governor Gina Raimondo anticipates the project is the beginning of a new industry, but some locals are skeptical.
Number 4 is The Wind of Change France Turns to Turbines. In 2015, France launched an ambitious project that aims to see the country win off its long-standing dependence on nuclear power. The goal is to reach a more balanced energy mix, set to include 40% of renewable energy by 2030. Wind energy will play a key role in reaching that target. But while environmental awareness is growing, not everyone is on board with seeing a wind farm spring up on their doorstep. Number 5 is China Installs Wind Turbine at Sea China successfully installed a pre-assembled wind turbine into a fixed foundation in an offshore wind farm off the coast of East China's Jiangsu Province. Before the installation, the tower and the turbine were completely assembled onshore and then tugged to the wind farm that is 42 kilometers offshore from Dongtai, a city of Jiangsu. Number 6 is world's first floating wind farm being built in Scotland. Off the coast of Aberdeenshire, a company called Statoil has built the world's first floating wind farm, High Wind Scotland. According to EcoWatch, though the farm has only been in operation for three months, it is already exceeding expectation in terms of energy production. Number 7 is largest wind farm ever constructed in Colorado. Excel Energy constructed the largest wind farm ever built in Colorado. It included 300 turbines, as well as the vast network of underground cables and above-ground power lines. It's an expensive wind farm covering 90,000 acres and five counties on the eastern plains near Simla.
And so that's all there is to it for today. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and share this with others. Once again, this is Arthur. And this is Richard Aguilar. Thanks for watching and see you next time.